The weather is bad, so I'm going to take the opportunity to quickly pop into one of the supermarkets here. And this is uh, Welcome. It's in Yilan. I'm not sure if it's a typical representation of uh, supermarkets in Taiwan. We've been to a few, but it's not really the norm. And we'll have a quick look around and just get an idea of what the average stuff costs. Okay, uh, let's have a quick look here. Okay, pineapples 49, on average 1.2 kilograms. Let's have a look here yeah, at the fruit stuffies. Mm. It seems like they sell it per piece, so it's 49 for two apples, little bags of apples here. Six apples for 89. And there's slightly bigger apples here, two for 49. It's quite pricey, let's have a look at the veggies. Oh, yeah, some discount pineapple. That's actually quite a good price. For a skin pineapple, 49. <clears throat> yeah, you can see loose bananas. Uh, 10 per banana and 19 per apple. Avocado is very expensive, 50 per, per avocado or then I guess two for 100. So, uh, spring onion ranges from 21 to 45 for a pack depending on the size all kinds of veggies here let's have a look some carrots you just one carrot giant carrot for 28 and then a uh, triple pack for 60 and you get these bags giant bags of carrots here 48 not too bad i guess mushrooms 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 oh you can get some garlic these mushrooms are super cheap. So you can get like these, uh, what do they call these golden mushrooms for 10 a pack. And I'm not, don't know, this is a king oyster mushroom. Yeah, for 55, for three. And oh, here's a whole bag of king oyster mushrooms. Looks like they've been cleaned for 129. Nice. Okay, eggs. Let's have a look. Looks like 18 eggs on a special year for 89 here at the bottom. And I guess two times, I don't know how many, those are 10. So it's 10 eggs, 20 eggs for 169. So that's not a bad deal actually, on average. Oh, there's a lot more eggs here. You can do 10 eggs on this side for 48. All right, um, let's just take a look at these veggies quickly. Onions, I guess it's per piece, or do you think it's by weight? Sweet potato, looks like little packets of sweet potato. All right, so we go down the, the meat, meat aisle quickly. Meat journey quite expensive, I've noticed. You can get like, um, you see there's like s strip steaks here at the bottom. Wagyu no I guess this is price per pack. You can see little packs of steak here. Um, I don't see the price per weight. But it comes to 60, 73 for these other guys. Oh, these are like a real steaks. This looks like a fillet steak of some sorts. 30, 32 for, what's it, half a kilo? Six, 650 gram. I don't see the weight per kilo here. Hard to say. All right, so a quick look. Chicken, 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 chicken fillets. Mm, not really, it's like chicken breasts here. D-bone chicken breasts for 300 grams of 79 and then we have um, some pork, pork, there's some uh, ground pork here at the bottom, ground pork 69, so what's it per kilo, I'm not sure, 85 I guess it's like, no idea, or pieces of pork, pork chops. Okay, let's move on to the fishies. The range of fish seems like they mock the fish down depending on how long it's been on the shelf uh, every day. Like here's some salmon cutlets here at the bottom. 200 grams for around $117. And you can work your price out from there. Little squids. Squids seems to be on special at the moment. And that's, um, not sure what the weight is of that. Or pack for 16. That's actually not bad. Seafood's generally not bad. There's all kinds of fish balls and there's some clams here at the bottom and also some oysters. Oyster? Yo, can you buy a whole pack of oysters for like 60? Do you think that's possible? That seems like a good deal. 
All right. Okay, quickly this side. I'm guessing these are milk. You think this is milk? So they like okay, so this is two liter milk, 57, and there's all kinds of flavored milks here. It seems like I can't figure there's a fruit milk, uh, chocolate milk. I guess these are normal milks as well, ranging from 57 to 59. Yes, slightly smaller, smaller bottles. Oh, uh, yes, and then lots of juices on this side. Let's have a quick look. So, orange juice for a liter, 100. Uh, ranges. Now, what's typical here? Yogurts. So, it's an idea of plain yogurts. The yogurts are quite pricey, we found. Like these guys are ranging from 129 to 145 for close to 500 grams of yogurt. All the smaller guys at the bottom, or 99 for two. Then you get probably four in the back. Have a look at the beers. That one is beer, 159 for six local beers. And I don't think you're gonna get much cheaper than that. Some bottled water, this is small bottles. We'll look for some big bottles here. Okay, quickly for coffee. We actually had a look at the coffee yesterday. And if you buy like a fairly decent instant coffee, this is Cafe Gold. This is uh, 120 grams, 239. Uh, you can get the refills. This is uh, 100 grams to 15. Or you can get a whole range of different coffees. Uh, they're quite big on their coffee here. You can actually buy the beans. Here's like uh, beans at the top here. Mr. Mr. Brown coffee beans. This is 360 grams of beans for 290. Um, 368 for two of these guys. There's also beans. And that's 450 grams. So you can get 900 grams of beans for 368, very good. Tea bags, oh gosh, okay, there's a whole lot of different teas. I think the local tea is obviously the black, black, black tea, and then also the um, the oolong tea, like yeah. So yeah, 50 tea bags for 135, here's 50 bags of the jasmine tea for 85, and then here's like salon teas, you can see um, yellow label, 100 bags for 134. <clears throat> the interesting selection of of cereals here. Uh, if you want like oats or something, let's see. Here's a, like a granola here at the bottom. Mm, ranges from 236, that's about 87 per 100 grams. And here's more oats here for 28 per 100 grams. So like a bag of kind of oats. Okay, let's move on to the condiments and honey, this is nice, oolong honey, 100 grams, 200, I can buy a big guy like this, 700 grams for 199 on special, that's not bad. Now we found the ice cream to be very expensive here, if you go for brand name ice cream like Ben and Jerry's, be prepared to pay 300 for a tub that is massively expensive i'm not sure if you can buy slightly more local i guess this is like meiji which is a local brand for a slightly bigger tub that's 700 grams for 150 not bad tins of tuna it pretty much depends what you buy seems like it's different sizes and from 42 for 10 to 3 for 99 Baked beans up here, 65 for a tin, that's what I see. Uh, there's all kinds of ready mixes, I guess. You just add your meat, 79 for three boxes. And then, this kind of, uh, what's on this side? Mostly condiments. Okay, we'll skip this guy. Let's just have a look and see. Oh, soy sauce for Africa. Some pastas, let's get an idea for pasta prices. The bottom here, spaghetti, 79 for a pack, I guess 500 grams. And what's this, penne, 79 a pack. Buy like pasta sauces from 125 at the top to 135 pasta sauces. 
and mustard 130 to 140 for a little tub and what's this olives fitted black olives 75 fitted black olives get an idea of all the instant noodles you can buy very very popular this this style of um, instant noodles or ramen soup where you can just add some boiling water I mean there's piles here I mean these are like 22 a pop it's like ridiculously cheap and you can buy big ones here for 32 some of them are great others are super spicy um, but you can make a proper meal here's a like a chicken style for 19 goodness gracious okay so you can keep yourself busy here for, with noodles for a while it seems like there's more um, thin noodles you can boil yourself a big giant pack of noodles for like 120 odd a little bit more spaghetti 65 here at the top and more pasta sauces here's a nice giant Papa Alfredo for 99 and then this whole aisle is just rice oh lordy okay so it seems like you can buy rice for 71 rand or 70 sorry you can buy rice for 71 a kilogram 99 a kilogram um, gosh okay so it's around that price range depending on the volume and the type of rice I'm not sure what the difference is between all these rices no idea some oil cooking oil looks like sunflower oil of some sort 110 for two for one liter i guess the cheapest one where we have like a blended oil here at the bottom soybean oil at the bottom 162 for what's that two liters on tell and then this is like olive oils this is like I'm not sure if this is is extra virgin olive oil um, a liter for 329 uh, all right toothpaste there's quite a range of it we think it's rather pricey if you look i don't know if the, they're quite bigger if you look at the, the colgate brands it's 197 for a tube 110 grams and it goes down for the local stuff to 55 and all the way up to 195 197 all range of uh, mouthwash these brushes here and i'll swing over to this side quickly shampoo oh you can get a uh, good range like here's a good one and pantene shampoo giant bottle seven more 179 uh, i don't know what these brands are but they look pretty good two for 40 249 and body wash this is all body washes body washes body wash like this dove 169 for no idea what the volume is huge and then some soaps a more soap you know a little pack of soap yeah 75 or something better, I guess, like a dove soap for 40. All right, so here's some washing powders, I guess. Um, those are tablets. These are liquids at the bottom. 2.7 kilograms for 199. 165, 165. What would be a brand that we know? Uh, Skip Ultimate, no idea. We know that one. Ariel, here we go. That's a pretty well known one. And that's 149. Looks like a special. And while we're here, we can have a look at the toilet paper. I think this is toilet paper. Kitchen towels. No, this is kitchen towels. This is toilet paper. Here we go. Kleenex. Six rolls for 89. Six rolls for 69. If you go bigger, tissue paper. Interchangeable, we found. You don't really know what's tissues and what's uh, toilet paper. Here's like Lay's, what we know. Let's have a Lay of Pringles here at the top. Ten of Pringles, 88 for two. I see a small ten for 51. 88 for two is pretty big. Here's a Lay's one, 69 here at the top. Bag of chips, 45. 
Uh, yeah, you can get 50, 50 for for two. Mm. Seems like a bargain. <clears throat> Lots of local flavored lays. Seaweed, 45. Um, I don't even know what we're looking at here, to be honest. All kinds of uh, chippies. Lays, mostly lays, lots of shrimp flavored chips. Shrimp flavor in with these, 20 a packet. And then I'll show you the biscuits quickly. Lots of sweets. Um, I don't know what to be typical. Oreos. Hmm. Box of Oreos, 40, 42. Mm -hmm. Maybe some some salty crackers. Roots, 33. Uh, digestive biscuits, 235 for 100 gram. Oh, you already got one. <laughs> and then some crackers, soda crackers, soda crackers, soda crackers for 32 for a pack of 140 grams. Okay, let's go down out here and down the bottom. All right, don't buy chocolate in Taiwan, especially not lint. Very expensive, 169 for 100 grams. We found it crazy expensive. There's some Meiji here. You can see 50 grams, 45. Still think it's expensive. Um, some of the stuff's not so bad. Inder, bueno. But on average, there's no shortage of sweet stuff. Let's have a look at some of the fresh stuff. Um, the weird rolls here. Like a sweetish roll, 10, 10 croissants, baby croissants, 10 each. Um, bread. There should be some bread here somewhere. Yes. Let's have a look. Oh, I know what this is. This is like sliced bread for 32 to 30. Um, some water, let's look at the coke, what's this, uh, 1.25 liters, 26, uh, what else can we see, bottled water, let's see bottled water here actually, you see large bottled waters, no, just small bottled waters here, water is really expensive we found, see here, anything from 16, you can get uh, 600 more down to 10, these are all smaller bottles, 600 more Sprite, 23, Diet Coke, 23, and give you an idea, um, Nutella for 85, hmm, what else there, little jams, I someone bought all the jams, all strawberry jams, 110, alright so these are all coffees, thin coffees, thin coffees, Mr. Brown thin coffee, 240 ml for 4475, and there's loads and loads of different ones available from 27 for the bigger ones. Uh, these are teas, all black teas, 25 or 600 moles. Um, down to 20, 21, whole range of 99 for four. And yeah, it's like big water for what's it, six liters for 40. And you can see some bigger waters here. There's like a cheap one, what's this? Nine for one and a half liters. That's pretty cheap actually. No real chance to get sparkling water unfortunately, yeah. Unless you go for brand names like Schweppes. Or oh yes, oh, here we go. Here's a nice 1.2 liter for 48 sparkling water. Now wines I haven't really looked at. Yeah. So yeah, you can get an idea of whiskies in this specific shop. Let's see if there's something I recognize here. Mm, the spirits, the spirits, 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 beer, beer. Alright, so this is not the same stuff actually. No. Let's see. Sure, okay. Bottle of red wine, $2.99, 2 dollars so that's pretty much, seems like the normal bottle of white wine, even more expensive, $3.29, $3.99, okay, top tip, 
do not buy white wine in Taiwan. I think whiskey is actually a lot cheaper here. You can buy like a, okay, a bottle of black label Johnny Walker 819. And that's for 700 ml, so don't be fooled. That's actually not bad in the big scheme of things. Red label 700 ml, 399. Okay, so there you have it. Um, I don't know how accurate it is in terms of representation in Taiwan, but it gives you a rough idea of what some costs at least and I hope it can be of use to you. Anyway, thanks for watching. See you next time.